All right, so the last thing I'm gonna show you guys is how to make a buttonhole or mend a buttonhole. Sometimes buttonholes, they, um, the, the threads come out and then they, they separate. So you can do this technique to fix that. So what that last little piece of um, fabric that you have, you're gonna fold it like so. You're gonna take your button and you're gonna measure the um, the width of the button. So I put that right in the middle, take a pencil, and I'm just putting a little mark here on either side of the button. Then, so now I've got the length of the button. So now I'm gonna take my ruler and I'm going to do a quarter of an inch on either, um, either side of that marking. So I'm centering that. So I'm just putting it in the middle of the ruler here. All I need is two lines, which is a quarter of an inch. So I'm gonna put a little mark right here and a little mark there and a mark right in the center there. And I'm gonna do the same thing over on the other side. So I'm gonna do a quarter inch here and a quarter inch here and then I'll draw a line connecting those two dots here. I'm doing it lightly. And then I'm going to draw the center of the button there. And then one more here. That's right there. Now I'm going to take and fold this in half and I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut along that center line right there. Just make a little tiny little cut. Hopefully these scissors are... And then I'm going to stick the scissors inside where I made that clip. And I'm just going to clip to the width of the of the button. And do the same thing over here. So now I've created a hole so I can put the button in. Now we're gonna change up. And we're gonna do a double instead of a single. We've been um, sewing with a single all this time and now we're gonna do a double. And I'm putting the two ends together down here. I'm making an X on my finger Put my thumb down, roll it off, and then twist it. So now I've got a double knotted. Okay, working with two threads now. So now the, te the technique that we're going to do is called the blanket stitch. And you can do this on the edge of a blanket if you want to. So I'm going to start right Start, I'm starting on the inside here to hide my knot. And I'm gonna connect here on the end and I'm gonna go back almost in the same, actually almost in the same hole as where I started. And I'm gonna go. Now if it loops like that for you, just pull your thread. Okay, and I'm gonna do that one more time. And now I'm ready to start doing the blanket stitch. So I'm going to go inside the hole that I just cut and I'm going to go right on that line that I drew. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go through the loop here like that. Just slide that over. And then I'm going to do it again. I'm going to go inside the hole and I'm going to go really close to where I went on that last stitch and pull and then go through the loop. 
I'm going through both loops and pull. And if it kind of gets all tangly right there, you just kind of pull it and just Yeah. You see how my technique was? I just kind of pulled the threads. Once again, I'm going in the hole, close to the last one, and then go through the loop, both loops, and pull. This thing wants to get a... <laughs> I'm getting all tangled up here. Okay. And then... So if you're getting loops like this, just back it out. Kind of how I'm doing. Still looping on me. patience. There we go. Finally fixed it. So you notice I didn't give up. I just kept working at it and working at it. That's what I want you to do. So let's drop this a little bit and let it untwist a little. There we go. See if that helps.
right? So now I'm at the end. So what I'm going to do is go and tack down this end. So there's one, two, Okay, and now I'm ready to start on the other side. I'm gonna start close in here, go through the loop, and then go inside, go through the loop, and then the inside. For some reason this one this side's going faster. Almost there. Almost there, I've got to do one more stitch. All right, now we're going to tie it off now. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and take a small little stitch off to the side here. Another little stitch down the side right here. All right, and then we're gonna go through the loop, pull, and then we're gonna do our lasso. Here's the lasso right there. Put my finger there, pull, and then I'm going to clip close to the knot. And there's your buttonhole, there.